desperate refugees who happen to come from camps in Jordan and Lebanon and who happen to be Syrian go through. It is more than 21. And in fact, the last one says, prior to entry to the United States, applicants are subject to screening again from the U.S. Customs and Bureau uh, Border Patrol. Applicants undergo a number 20, a second interagency security check. That's after 19 other security checks. I want to thank Lutheran Services, Catholic Charities, Interfaith Ministries for recognizing the importance of the face of America to be a refuge for those who are worn and desperate. I want to join my colleagues to say that we all have a responsibility for national security. I hope the Senate will engage in vigorous debate that the President will announce to the world that we are fighting ISIS. We are joining allies and taking it uh, to the fight. But we must do other things besides denying and stopping innocent refugees from coming in a small, small number. Secure our airports. Ensure that the backside of the airport is secure. Uh, make sure that no foreign fighter is able to come into the United States. And I've introduced legislation for this. We're not for not protecting, we are for protecting, but we must do it in a way that America has been able to stand up and be respectful or recognizing, of course, all of those the who come and time struggle. Has expired. I thank you, Mr. Speaker. Happy Thanksgiving, and I yield back. I know we are a great country, and I know those know that we are. The gentleman I yield back. yields back for what?